What happened in Paris is shocking and so very sad. Unfortunately, it will undoubtedly begin another cycle of violence, followed by retaliation, followed by more violence, and so on. It's been happening this way a very long time. Humans are very good at spotting differences, probably an old survival mechanism. It can be differences in religion, skin color, or species. And we fear things that are different from what we are and what we've been taught to believe. We treat beings that we perceive as different as less than ourselves, as mere things. This allows us to perpetrate atrocities toward each other. Veganism breaks this chain. With veganism, you become mindful of what you're ingesting. You reject part of culture into which you were indoctrinated. When you do that, you begin to see in how many other ways you have internalized your tribal values. You can finally see how all humans and non-humans are more alike than different. There's no need to fear others. Without the fuel of fear, hate and violence can't survive. It sounds cliche, but peace really does start on your plate and then emanates out into the world. I'd like to read you something from Dr. Will Tuttle. The contemporary vegan movement is founded on loving kindness and mindfulness of our effects on others. It is revolutionary because it transcends and renounces the violent core of the hurting culture in which we live. It is founded on living the truth of interconnectedness and thereby consciously minimizing the suffering we impose on animals, humans, and biosystems. It frees us all from the slavery of becoming mere commodities. It signifies the birth of a new consciousness, the resurrection of intelligence and compassion, and the basic rejection of cruelty and domination. It is our only real hope for the future of our species because it addresses the cause rather than being concerned merely with the effects. Thank you.